Hi friends, welcome to Padu's Kitchen. In today's video, we are going to see how to make coconut jaggery paisam or kheer. This is a traditional paisam prepared with fresh coconut, jaggery and rice. This paisam is usually served chilled and believe me, it tastes heavenly. Let's get on to the recipe. I have soaked 2 teaspoons of raw rice in boiling water. This should soak for an hour. Soak 7 to 8 cashew nuts and almonds in plain water for an hour. So let's see what ingredients we need to make this paisam. Freshly grated coconut half cup, soaked raw rice, cardamom 3, jaggery half cup, cashew nuts and raisins for garnishing, soaked cashew nuts and almonds, half liter milk, now we will start making the paisam. This paisam will serve 3 persons. First we will boil the milk. Boil until it reduces a little. This is 2 and a half cups of milk. Let it reduce to 2 cups. Keep stirring so that it will not get burnt. The milk has reduced a little. I am turning off the heat. Let this cool completely. Then we will refrigerate the milk. In a mixie, add half cup of grated coconut, cardamom powder, soaked rice. We are going to grind this coarsely with half cup of water. Do not add all the water at a time. Add gradually and grind it coarsely. Coconut paste is ready. We will transfer this to a bowl. Rinse the mixie with another half cup of water and add that also. Now we will pressure cook this keeping this vessel inside the cooker not directly. Pressure cook for 3 vessels. While this is cooking we will grind the soaked almonds and cashew nuts coarsely with little water. Peel the skin of almonds. Cashew nut almond paste is ready. Add half cup of jaggery in a pan. Add half cup of water. Heat the water and dissolve the jaggery. Then filter it. I am adding the filtered jaggery water. Boil the jaggery water for few minutes on medium heat. Turn off the heat. No need to prepare any syrup. Now the pressure has subsided. We will open the cooker and check. Add the cooked coconut paste to the jaggery. Ground almond and cashew nut paste. Mix this well. Boil this. This has started boiling. Boil for 2 to 3 minutes. Now it's almost 3 minutes. I'm turning off the heat. Let this cool completely. This has cooled completely. I'm adding the chilled milk which we had refrigerated. We will garnish it with cashew nuts and raisins now. Heat a teaspoon of ghee. Add the chopped cashew nuts. The cashew nuts have started to brown. Add the raisins now. Fry both together. The raisins have puffed up. I am turning off the heat. Add this to the paisam. Chill this for a few hours in the refrigerator and then serve. Serve this paisam chilled. This is a very very delicious paisam. Do try this and leave your feedback. Do like and share this post. Don't forget to subscribe to Padu's Kitchen. Also click the bell icon to get notifications as and when I post videos. Thank you.